So okay, this is a real funky machine you've been. Oh, she's she wouldn't get anything else. You like her? But whenever you sit 19 hours in a day on something, you get the like her. Uh, you get the like her, so you do. I've been sitting her all day long, no bother. So what is she exactly? She's a class serial saddle track. Yeah. 3800. Oh, it is. They're just there at the minute. They were driving her at the minute with crab steer. You know, it's, some fields she's good in, and other fields she's she's not so good in. Like that last field that we were in, you know, it was far too muddy, mm -hmm. and she just wanted to pull the muck, you know, because the wheels are going the different direction. But so I just drove her in the standard and we got through it right, Labour. Yeah. This grinds a wee bit drier now. So we're out Kirkcoven direction with John Steele and Son. John Steele and Son, we're yeah. actually down here beside Kirkus and Racetrack there. Out spreading a bit. That band's creeping up quicker than everyone's expecting, isn't it? How did you get on this year? Aye, not too bad. Year. Grass is, you know, the grass has been good. You know, other other times it's been wet, you know, and you're just dodging through it. It's like everything else, you just had to work with it. Aye, a lot of snatch and grab the year. Uh, aye, yeah. When did this machine come into the yard? Oh, this came off the lorry by, we were actually at the slurry with the dribble bars and the pipes in the February. The 14th of February it was delivered. From that, you know, we've just toyed about with her and get ready to be out going, working, earn, earning some earning some keep. Take a bit of getting used to it, did it? I did, I surely, but I'll tell you, if it wasn't for a big lad, Kyle Stewart, we're blind, like. Yeah. We're blind here with this. And big Kyle helped us out quite a lot, you know, and then you, he left you to it. I'm sure he's just at the end of the phone. Uh, you were telling me earlier she was not in English at all there, or whatever she No, nah, some of the old sentences was in the foreign old language, you know, and <laughs> took a wee minute or two to get out round it. We... But you can get the hang of it anyway. Aye, uh, yeah, I'm sort of getting there now. Yeah. Like, sir, every day's a learning day. Yeah. But... What do you reckon it's like compared to a day of the pipes? Like, do you reckon... So you wouldn't go back? No. She had her reeling out and reeling up and Oh, setting up and whatever, do you, uh, do your head in. Too much it's, hassle. Too much hassle, boy. This year, two tankers. I can work with two tankers mostly all day, and they'll they'll keep you going, no bother, with a short draw. Yeah. And if we're stuck with a long draw, we'll bring in a third one, and even even the, the Arctic there, you know, we'll get her in as well with a big draw. A lot of places we've been, they can work away comfortably with two. I you have a few big tankers in the go, and uh, the Arctic, as you were saying. Uh, the Red Rock, New Rock, New Rock, 3,500 gallon tankers. Aye, so this here has got the big suction arm in the front of her. Sucks out of the, the tankers then. Sure. They're all set up for this thing. Well, all, well, he got the, all the tankers all set up there. One came already with the cone in it. The other two tankers and the, the Arctic, he got it set up then with the, the cone on the back. Is he long? Sucking the load out of it? No. Two minutes and 18 seconds. Right. And that's a three and a half the thousand. three and a half thousand gallon tanker. The one that came ready made is his latest tanker there with the, the, the hose that was built down and through the inside of her. She's the wider hose. Yeah. Two minutes, 18 seconds. We boy up the road, Sam McKee made pipes there for the back of her and she takes a wee bit longer. The hose just wouldn't be as big or the pipes just wouldn't be as big. Two minutes, 30 seconds, two minutes, 40, you know. Still quick. So this here holds three and a half thousand gallon then? No water? Well, at the start, we didn't really know much about her, you know, there yeah. wasn't really we we'll had to adjust the float and all in her, but she takes the full load. Sometimes there you're working well, digest it, you know, and it'll be frothy, you know, and it, whenever she's taking the load out, there's a big pipe on the side of her, we discharge pipe. Yeah. You could hold it in an egg cup full, you know, whenever she runs out of her. Have the lorry, what size uh, tanker is it running then? Well, we'll get two, two of these out of her, so what's a 7,000 gallon? Right. Two, two of these at three and a half thousand gallon, that's 7,000 gallon. Uh, do you know what? Well, his idea was and why he decided to go for this machine. Just to speed things up. See, you couldn't get any quicker now. Yeah. Like, like how do you beat that? You, you can fly up and down the field, to be fair. Like. Oh, well, it's, it all depends. You know, it's up and down the rate. It's all on the computer here. Yeah. If you want 4,000 gallon, like, you, you put it into the into the Zunhammer box and then she'll tell the tractor what to do, what speed to do. Right. Then this here isn't the only way you spread, sorry. You have the dribble bar as well. Oh, aye, yeah, yeah, yeah. And tankers. Tankers. And then and he has the other the other pipe system there yeah. with the other dribble bar if he needs to be on you go. So like. what's the, the dribble bar he's running then? They're 12 metre dribbler bars, they're uh, slurry quips. Yeah. So they're, they're not bad. I can't have felt them anyway. Yeah. And then he has a containers as well. Or a container. Oh, nurse tank? Yeah, oh, nurse aye. Tank. Yeah. So whenever it gets wet then, real wet. Whenever she, gets, whenever she gets real wet, that's whenever you see that. The nurse tank comes out. The nurse tank coming out. The gas there, what he had it out yesterday, didn't do much with it because yeah. the fields were too wet. Uh, tomorrow, Saturday, she'll be busy now tomorrow. So 
maybe this is the end, maybe this is the last day of this thing being out like. You know, and that's not bad from the 14th of April and hasn't stopped now. Okay. Are you the only man for her then? Oh, God, yeah. I sort of kind of, you get big help from Kyle. Yeah. It's just at the end of the phone. But there's another wee lad there, wee Connell, you, you know him there. He be the driver. Not much, like, but he, do, he knows how to drive her. If I'm off, will he, will he be the driver too, like? Do you enjoy it then, the area on pump? She wouldn't look back. To be fair, some job, but she's going up and down the field, like. Oh, unbelievable. See? No, I wouldn't look back, like. No, it's a, it's a, it's a real good system. To yeah, be fair. yeah. Especially in that drier ground, like whenever you can get your crabs to go on and your ground compaction well, uh, is fairly reduced. Definitely, yeah. Mm. Sometimes they should catch you. But uh, you giving any bother at all over the. Sure, she's like everything, by yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Or like, They're just wee niggly bits, you yeah. know, there's nothing major. Like, I'm happy enough with it, Willie's happy enough with it. And yeah. And it's been non stop since February. It hasn't stopped the 14th of February to now. Eight, just over 800 hours put on her. Yeah. And pro I would say probably this will be the last day with her. Like, put her away for the winter then, get her all cleaned up. <laughs> just said he take your time at it, make sure you get everything right. Yeah. Spray it all off with oil, put her away then, that's her. For the next season. You reckon it's been a great investment then? From Willie's point of view, it probably is, yeah. Yeah. For, I, the amount of slurry is her shifting. And I see it was another tractor or whenever the boys are away at grass. Whenever Willie would go out with the pipes, you have a man in the pump, you have a man in the, the pipes, three, maybe four, sometimes five tankers. They can and go out all day long. Yeah. But this year, like, you know, you're less men, less hassle, less grief. More spread in the end. I think so, but... but say you got, you're got you on a tankers the whole day, you know, I say between it and your umbilical. Well, I don't know, them boys on a good day with four and five tankers and stuff. I think them boys can put out maybe just over 400,000 or maybe less. Right. 400,000. Well, I can work with my biggest day. We went out and Willie came that morning, it was a long draw, and he came for three hours. We were left with two tankers and it was out just out around the yard. And we get 380,000 gallons out in that one day, like. That's all shit, to be fair, like. I'd say the farmer was happy that day. He did toy about buying uh, quite a grubber at the start, but you're half the, the, the ground down here in the lower arch. It's full of rock. You'd uh, pull the back end out of her, so I think he was toying maybe with a disc injector, you know, so yeah. she's, she's cutting up the ground. She's not rubbing it, you know. She's I've been sure all that rock makes it the dry ground of the, the country. Oh, I, I, whenever we're wet, I'm sure everybody else is bound to be wet. Everyone, like. everyone. You just normally have it nice out here. I wouldn't be saying that now. Like sometimes we get our bad here, do you? You know, whenever, whenever everyone else in the country stopped, you are always still at it. I wouldn't say still at it, but still doing something. Giving like. it a go, anyway. Yeah. I'd say you just put through some hours and summer anyway. Oh, I know, no, no, to be fair to him though, you would, some weeks there you're pushing in 110, some of us near touching 120 hours a week like, so some of us would maybe be glad here the, the slurry ban and stuff coming in here. Yeah. But sure whenever you go home and you're lying up for a day or two days and you're wishing you were back out at it. Where's my ex area on that? Oh yeah, yeah, I'll go, I'll go up to the yard here hey, and see if we can find something to talk about that. So well, he loves his new rock tankers as well then, does he? So far he's stuck by them, like, yeah. you know, he's had a few through him there now. But uh, happy enough. Uh, uh, you know, you work hard all year. And there's a good team of boys here, now, in fairness. Uh, some of them would be good out of lads, like. Aye. Uh, a good team of lads, now. Well, sure. I'll let you get back to your story here. Oh, I don't want to bother with. No. Good man. Cheers.